I'm Jessica Cartaglia with your evening digital news brief for Friday, April 23rd, 2021. Tragedy in Burlington County. Police say a teen was shot and killed outside of his home. The victim is 18-year-old Yasin Robinson. His family says he was a senior at Willingboro High School, and they tell us that he was on the honor roll, and he was a chess master and a musician. Police say that the shooting happened last night on Barrington Lane around 11.30. The investigation is ongoing, and no one has been arrested. An update to a story that we've been reporting all week. Authorities in Lancaster County say asphyxia due to strangulation and suffocation was the cause of death for Linda Stoltzfus. The 18-year-old Amish woman was reported missing 10 months ago. Her remains were found Wednesday. The coroner's office also said a stab wound was a contributing factor in her death. The suspect in her murder, Husto Smoker, remains in custody. A Philadelphia man is facing murder charges in connection to shooting the shooting death of a woman in Lansdale. Police say 52-year-old Ricky Vance shot and killed Ebony Pack in November. Using surveillance video, police say that they saw Vance's car pull up to the victim's car at the intersection of East Hancock and Church Road. The video then shows Pack's car rolling into traffic after she was shot. Police do not believe that Vance acted alone. They're asking anyone with information to come forward. And two men have died after a tractor trailer hit a bridge on the New Jersey Turnpike. Chopper 3 was over the scene around 9.30 last night near the I-195 interchange in Robbinsville Township. Investigators say the tractor trailer crashed into a guardrail, then into a concrete bridge support. The truck driver and passenger were killed. You can always get the latest on these stories and more here on CBSPhilly.com. That's the latest for the evening digital brief. I'm Jessica Cartalia.